Greetings Assassins and welcome to Eurogamer and another live stream. Today's live stream, pretty special, big release day today. It's the release of Assassin's Creed Unity in America. Doesn't release until uh, Friday here in the UK. But it's been, uh, it's been on sale now for about 10 hours or so in America. Uh, the review embargo has just lifted. The review, our review has now gone live right here, Eurogamer.net. If you want to check that out, don't close this window. Um, stick around with this live stream. Keep this running while you uh, read the review. I'm not going to spoil the score for you. You can scroll to the bottom of the review and read the score yourself. Um, but it's a definitely an interesting score, that's for sure. So, uh, yeah, what's going on in today's uh, live stream? I'm going to be streaming two hours worth of Assassin's Creed Unity. I'm going to be trying to keep spoilers to a minimum. There may be spoilers in this live stream if you've been looking forward to this stream. Uh, I apologise in advance. Uh, there might be spoilers so you may need to turn off. What I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be doing open world stuff. So I'm going to be trying, I'm going to be running all around Paris. I'm going to be trying to uh, get all the synchronisation points. I'm going to be doing mini missions, um, side quests. Uh, I might do a story mission or two depending on whether I'd start running out of stuff. And I'm also, um, that you competition lovers might be uh, happy to hear, I'm also going to be giving away some prizes. Um, I have got, now, I'll go in kind of um, reverse order, I guess. I have got to give away to you guys, I've got three PS4 copies of Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. Uh, Region 2, these are. All of these games are Region 2, so Euro UK or Europe, I'm afraid, for the games. Uh, I have got three copies of Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag for the Xbox One to give away to you guys. I've got three copies of Assassin's Creed Unity on the Xbox One to give away that are promotional copies. So these are review copies. And I've got one special edition of Assassin's Creed Unity for the Xbox One to give away. This includes 30 minutes of additional gameplay. Now, massive apologies, I don't have any Assassin's Creed Unity um, to give away for the PlayStation 4. I wasn't sent any. I took what I could give. Ubisoft were very kind. Uh, they were kind enough to send me some stuff. Um, quite a lot of games to give away, uh, but no uh, PS4 versions, I'm afraid. I'm playing the PS4 version in this stream, though, so you'll be seeing the PS4 version in action. There's also one more thing that I'm going to give away. Um, and I'll be giving these away, uh, these away throughout the stream. Maybe one giveaway at six and one giveaway just before I finish the stream at seven. So I do it in chunks. The other thing I have to give away is this, which is pretty awesome. It is an Assassin's Creed black flag. I'll try and keep it still for a second. It's a gunboat takeover Mega Blocks thing. So it's kind of like Lego, but it's Mega Blocks, and you can build your own Jackdaw. You've got Kenway and his crew there, um, and it's it's quite a big box. It's got 800, uh, 580 pieces in it as well. So loads of cool stuff uh, in these giveaways coming up later on. I'll be doing the normal kind of drawing names from a hat thing uh, because I I don't have very good um, technology to do that sort of stuff. Uh, but Anyway, let's get on with the game. Let's do some shout-outs while I'm uh, sorting stuff out, actually. Uh, we've got Sam Moore here. We've got Shakespeare, Hurricane of 87. Uh, Ms. Fraggle Rock says, Bonjour, mes amis. Oh, my headphones aren't turned on. That's annoying. Uh, the floppy point on Ian Sid should give you an idea of Eurogamer's review score. I don't know what that means. Uh, this, is a, um, this is my dressing gown. I bought this. There's a company on the internet that sells gaming clothes. It's called Insert Coin. .co.uk I think it is and they did like a, a sale uh, recently like a 75% off sale of all their um, old stock so I got an Assassin's Creed dressing gown um, I got a I got a Far Cry 3 t-shirt I got a t-shirt for body count I don't know if you ever remember that like really rubbish Codemasters um, first person shooter it was like 3 quid because it was in the sale I basically spent about 40 quid 
um, on really cheap t-shirts uh, and stuff. So, and I thought, oh, I might as well uh, wear an Assassin's Creed hood for this special Assassin's Creed stream. I'm not giving away my dressing gown. You wouldn't want it, honestly. This has had about six months worth of wear. It's doidy. It's doidy. Right. Let's um, let's get the game going. So apologies for me having to get up and plug my headphones in. Hello, I'm up here now. So, welcome to Paris. This is Paris on the PlayStation 4. Now, uh, I've skipped the... I've played through the first, I don't know, maybe 45 minutes to an hour. I have... A bit of screen tear as it turns out. I have skipped the spoilery beginning. It's a bit spoilery at the beginning. And now I'm Arno... The character here, you can see here. I'm at the top of Notre Dame, I think it is. Notre Dame. And if we look at the map, we've got like the whole of Paris to explore. So I'm going to try my best to just explore Paris, get into some mischief, find some, um, find some hidden like chests, do some, maybe some side quests if I can find any of. Is that side quests? It might be. That's a mission. That's a main mission there, Rebirth. So I'll probably try and avoid that if I can. Now, a lot of there's been a lot of buzz about this recently because uh, lots of people have been finding glitches. Um, it's very buggy. Uh, lots of people have been saying the frame rate is uh, pretty bad as well. I can confirm that the frame rate is pretty shoddy at times. Um, they, it's really good showing off the crowds below there's a whole crowd of people it won't really slow down when I get down there but there's points where it slows down a lot and um, the way uh, Arno navigates around uh, there's been so many times where I've got like caught on something and just kind of span around until he's managed to pop clear and stuff which is a little bit um, a little bit bad considering well uh oh I think I've just killed myself <laughs> well that's the first death nine minutes into the stream He's got a mind of his own, this guy. I pointed him towards that hay bale. Uh, he has got next-gen hair. I haven't tried out any next-gen bushes yet, though. I haven't seen any bushes to run through. But I'll try out next-gen bush as soon as I can. See if, uh, see if this game's got next-gen bush. And I'm pretty sure it will have done. Um, Timbo Tim, Indie Kings, James Bravery and Brash Games have followed me on Twitter, by the way. So thank you very much for following me on Twitter. You'll get updates on all our live streams uh, on Twitter as well. So here we are. We're back in, in Paris. Spinning the camera, just spinning the camera now. You can see that it's dropping frames quite badly. It's like... Dun, 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 dun. Um, this is playing after a 900 megabyte first day patch has been installed as well. So um, I think my, I think Ubisoft are probably going to be working very hard to build to get a new patch in uh, because uh, we I've seen tweets of like horrible glitches where people's faces are coming off and um, yeah lots of people talking about like really bad frame rates and things. Um, but does that get in the way of the gameplay experience? Frame rate wise, I'm never really that bothered about, although it does get a bit noticeable. I'm more uh, bothered about um, the fact that he sometimes glitches through floors and stuff. Uh, but there is screen tear as well. I'm sure Digital Foundry will be doing a report very soon. So let's find, let's mark on my map anyway, somewhere to go. I want to find a new synchronization point to open up another part of the city. What are these, actually, what are these things here? What's that? Paris stories, waxworks. So these ones, Paris stories, I think, are the mini missions. So I'll do some mini missions in a bit. Um, but first, well, there's even a bit of screen tear on the map, actually. <laughs> Crazy. Uh, first, let's go and... Let's go check out this viewpoint. Let's go and climb another viewpoint. See that that tower over there. Let's go and see what we can see in Paris. I didn't get a raise yet, Darren MC61. Jump! There we go. He's good at jumping, as um, old Arno. There's a couple of new things uh, in this game. 
one of the things I really like is the parkour down function. Instead of pressing like right trigger and X to climb up, you can press right trigger and down. And you really easy it's really easy to, to climb down things now. It used to be a bit of a mission to like parkour down things. Oh god, I'm being shot by someone. It used to be a real mission to climb down stuff, but now it's actually um, really um, really quite simple to get down from things you've climbed rather than having to wrestle with the controls to force him to drop off things. There's the tower I'm heading to. The recreation of Paris though is um, get up! Climb it! Jeez, climb it! Climb upwards. Why can't you climb up that? Still got the kind of the thing that frustrates me the most about Assassin's Creed games is just how for me, the characters never really go where I want them to go. Never really climb up what I want them to climb. Even if it looks like it should be climbable. I mean, that jump in real life, that that's no way. No way no one, anyone could have made that jump. But even I could have climbed from that chimney up to that wall. Um, but yeah, the, the recreation of Paris is uh, absolutely beautiful. If you've ever been to Paris... There's even like some of the like old famous buildings you'll you'll really notice, uh, you'll really recognise, especially um, Versailles. Versailles is really um, recognisable. Like I went to Versailles a few years ago, and uh, you go through some of the rooms that you go through if you go on the tour of Versailles, and it's uh, yeah, it's really good. Uh, amazing attention to detail. They've done a really good job at recreating revolutionary Paris. Oh geez, the flame frame rate is really sluggish, isn't it, says Steve Graham. Yes, it is, it is indeed. 20 frames per second on the map's a solid snake. Yeah, it's it it chugs. I've not had a chance to test it properly on the Xbox One yet. Uh, my only experience really has been on the PlayStation 4 version. Boing! Go on, climb it, climb it, climb it, climb it, come on, clamber up there. There he goes, he's climbing, he's climbing, he's climbing. Yeah, he's done it. That's what, oh my god, he just, oh, I thought he was going to die. I'm sort of looking forward to Assassin's Creed Rogue. Who said that? I'm not sure who said that. That went really, uh, Darren MC 61 said that. Uh, yeah, I, I kind of, I've been looking forward to, um, Assassin's Creed Rogue a bit more than this because I got very bored of the Assassin's Creed series and then I really liked Assassin's Creed Black Flag. I loved the ship stuff and Assassin's Creed Rogue's got more of that. It's more like Assassin's Creed Black Flag where I think this is a bit of a step back towards the old school Assassin's Creeding of stealthing through um, cities. The first like three missions in this game are really annoying sneak through here if you get caught you have to restart the whole thing which is missions that I really um, that aggravate me a little bit. Look at that, that's beautiful though isn't it? That is amazing. The amount of the amount of talent uh, it must take to recreate to make a world like that is incredible. <clears throat> Some of the texture detail is quite good, impressed by that says Sea Bleam. Yeah, visually it looks awesome it's just under the hood, I think there's a lot of problems. Do, 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 do. Someone wanted to know if I'd be doing Christmas giveaways as well. I will try my best to do Christmas giveaways like I did last year. I had about, I can't remember how many games I had to give away last year. It was, it was a hundred and something. I had codes to give away. Um, I will be doing that. Okay, oh god, that's not, that's not the map button. So I found another viewpoint. So now uh, the middle, the centre of Paris, this like kind of island here is opened up. I'm not going to do that main mission, but I think I might as well do I might as well do a mission. I'm going to try Waxworks, assassinate the Sans Colette leader Jean Lassard, who's stalking Madame Tussaud. So I'm going to head over there and do that mission now. So where do we get, where's a where's a Where's a hay bale? Oh, there's a hay bale. Handily, handily they've put a hay bale on the roof there. Just, just because, you know, hay bales on roofs. 
Versailles is very nice. I've been uh, I've never been there, but my history teacher in high school always told stories about it when he went to Steve Scott. Has it been confirmed that Just Cause 3 will be free to play, or was that just a rumour, says Rory Youngs? I've not heard anything about it um, being free to play um, at all, Rory Youngs, so it could be, but it might not be. <laughs> it may be, it might not be. That's 50 50 chance, as far as I know. I don't know if anyone else watching can uh, fill us in. Good going. Right, we're heading. Let's parkour down. Oh god, nearly landed on that poor lady's head. Poor lady's head. Uh, here we go. Here's the next. Here's the mission. It's a high difficulty mission. Buy weapons or skills or equipment to increase your level. I don't really. I don't really think that um, that I need to increase my level. I think I'm pretty damn good. I do definitely. I definitely need to increase uh, my level. To be honest. Um, but I'm going to try it anyway. The man who denounced me is furious that I've escaped the guillotine. He sent men to my shop to apprehend me. I dare not return there. Could you please go to my shop and make sure my assistants are safe? And please, please remove that horrid man. What? Uh oh, so I've got to assassinate some dude. Investigate Madame Sword's shop. Don't you keep your hay bales on your roof too, Ian? I thought everyone did. I used to, but they got damp in the rain. So now I keep them under tarpauling. Um. Wow, well, we've got 278 people watching. So, uh, welcome one and all if you're brand new. Feel free to subscribe for more early gameplay previews like this. Uh, Lol Lol says the fact of the streaming slows the frames. The streaming's capped at 60 frames per second. It may reduce the quality of the game slightly, but there's definite noticeable frame rate dropping, even though I'm you know, watching it not through the stream. I'm sure it's it's I'm sure it's something that can be patched. I'm sure it is, but Oh wait, where's the shop? Where am I going? At the moment. It's a little bit scruffs. Is that where I need to go? Is that invest? No, that's a new mission. Where's the shop? Where is it that she wanted me to go? Oh, is that it? I think it's that blob there. Get out of my way, guys! <laughs> So the Parisian streets are very busy. Lots of people to shove through. <laughs> and here's uh, Madame Tussaud's shop. Let's go and see what's up with these guys that are bullying the women. I'm going to steal something off this dude. You can go into a crouch position, uh, which is kind of new for Assassin's Creed games. I've stolen a letter from the Sartre's men. Keep watch over the shop. I'll take some men to a waxworks exhibition. She's sure to show up one place or another, and at last I'll exact my own measure of justice. Oh. Oh. Okay, so combat wise, you can parry and attack just like other Assassin's Creed games. You'll notice. Ow, oh, I think I died. That was my first time coming up against a heavy enemy there that you can't parry his attacks with. Whoopsie! The UK retail release for this is the 14th Windy Windmill. Everyone speaks English in uh, this version of Paris, uh, John and Bob. And is it possible to change the language uh, in French, for example, with subtitles? Or is it region locks as FR Player 1? Let's have a look for FR Player 1. Um... language. You can have French and you can have English subtitles. You 
You will lose progress since your last save. I'm changing it to French with English subtitles for a little bit just to see what happens. The animations look solid, says Gaming Megacast. Hello, Jimatep. Is this, uh... So now everyone's French. How can I attack this dude? It's not letting me draw my weapon. Pressing square. Oh, there we go. Oh no! So it wouldn't let me draw my weapon, and now I've attacked an innocent soldier. I just activated Eagle Vision as well. Mon Dieu! No, go away, Eagle Vision. Can I knock him out or anything? Why can't I do anything to this guy? He's pushing me around, but I can't draw my weapon and knock him out or anything. Oh, maybe I can now. Uh, looks like I had to anger them slightly before I could attack them. Can't just attack him out of the blue. Oh, stabbed through the chest. Oh, what a way to die. Right. I'm going to change it back to English anyway. I have a weird OCD um, where I have to do all sync points before doing anything. Ha ha ha, says Chris Thompson Drew. Hey, Lawrence Murphy. I definitely wouldn't judge the frame rates from watching this stream though. Wait for the Digital Foundry um, article. They'll have those amazing frame rate videos that they do and stuff like that. So they'll definitely be able to show it off better. This stream's more just for seeing how the gameplay works, getting an idea of the game and, um, and winning some prizes. Right, options. Let's quickly go back to sound options. I'll keep the subtitles on, but I'm going to put it back to English. English. Yes. This game looks nice so fast as Steve Scoots. That was my third death, I think. This is Assassin's Creed Unity Gaza Harris. I'm playing on the PlayStation 4. That's French for PlayStation 4. The PlayStation 4. Find Jean Lassard is the next mission. Looks like he's over there, that green dot. See what? Where are we going now? Through here? So yeah, my favourite Assassin's Creed is Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. Get out of my way, dude! Uh oh, someone's after me. So I'm being chased by someone, possibly some guards as well now. I just need to lose them by clambering over here. It says enemies remember you after conflict ends. Why did he jump that instead of running up that thing? Uh oh, Ooh, don't go any further. Right. So, Jean Lassard is going to be around here somewhere. If I use my eagle vision... Keep your distance. Let's, spot, let's spot some guards. Ah! Broken, broken legs. Oh! There is, so I need to kill that dude. Stay out. These are monuments to aristocrats. Get out. Can I kill him from Can I kill him from above? Doesn't look like I've got a doesn't look like I can. Kill. See, I think the thing is, because I'm right at the start of the game and I'm not actually... 
I've not actually, like, got my assassin skills yet. I don't think I can... Oh! I don't think I can do most of my, um, most of my skills. Like, most of the kind of... I haven't got, like, any blades or anything. I haven't even got an assassin's cloak. It is a bathrobe uh, remodulate. Hey, CS Crown. Do da do do do. Plastacion Quattro, says Lol Lol. That's, that's right, yeah. Plastacion Quattro. Right. See if I can uh, escape. There's people after me. See if I can escape them through the crowd. See, I can't. Yeah, I, I haven't got my. Um, I haven't got my assassin stuff yet, so that was. I need to just avoid the guy with the axe. He's like a heavy, heavy guy that I can't parry. You will suffer. Parry that dude though. Down. He's got this. This dude. Ah, uh, dodge him. Shot him. Ah. There we go. He's dead. Deaded. Now I must escape the area. There we go. Oh, there's the uh, there's the waxworks. Madame Tussauds waxworks. Let's see, because obviously famous Madame Tussaud. <laughs> Have they got that waxwork to balance that? Now, if I was making waxworks, I definitely wouldn't want my waxwork to be <laughs> to be presented hanging off the edge like that. If it fell, I'd be like, "You broke it! Why did you put it there?" I've escaped the area. My objective is complete. Hooray! And there we go. I got some rewards as well. Yo yo Ian, Assassin's Creed, can't wait to play this. Any co-op Let's Plays planned in, says Mr. Buggles. Uh, I haven't got any plan. I'm hoping to do one tomorrow with Tom Phillips from uh, Eurogamer, but that's before the game's out in the UK, so... And I'm out, I'm off work on Friday, so I won't be able to stream Friday. So, um... Yeah, I'm not sure. Memes user Chris McBeth and Jaeger Bombs have followed me on Twitter. So is Philip Gioras. Thank you very much for following me, guys and girls. Right, where are we going now? So that was one mission done. That was a bit of a harder mission to do. I'm not sure whether... Oh, I shouldn't really... I said I'd try and keep it um, spoiler-free, so I will. But it just means I haven't got very many... Assassin skills to show off because I'm still a wee baby. I'm a wee baby. Let's go to another viewpoint. 30 minutes through the stream right now. Oh, what's that? There's a letter on the other side of this building. Let's go see what that is. I love the blood, says Cold Guy 03. It's pretty gory, this one, that's for sure. Right, parkour down. Right on top of this letter, what is it? Is it oh, interact, there we go. Latitude escapes again. It's some newspaper article I, I read there. Um, it's given me a database entry, and that's about it. There's also chests to find, so let's go find this chest. Maybe it's in here. I think I should be able to spot it if I do my eagle vision. Yeah, it's above. Let's go get the chesticles. Chest away! Where are you going? Chesticles, spectacles, wallet and watch. Here's the chest. Yeah. 400 francs there. Nice. One chest collected out of 30 in this district. So plenty more chests to find. 
as I make my way towards that viewpoint over there. Um, is this just am I there? Is that me there? Where am I? Is that me? I think that's me there. Let's just keep going. See how fast I can make it across the rooftops. Doing. You go, dude. Keep climbing. Keep climbing, bro. That's it, bro. It's definitely a very athletic young chap. Oh my God! There's no way I'd ever do that jump. Been hospital for months. It's quite far away that tower. Gives us a good look at the um, kind of grimy, foggy Parisian streets. Let's go and have a look at the uh, the Zane as well. There's the Zane. Probably full of turn of the century poop. A lot of buildings are uh, enterable as well in this game, which is pretty cool. Oh, park all down, park all down. L2 to go. No, park no. In the in the in the window, in the window, in the in the window. Yeah, there we go. It's a chest. He looks like Roberto Baggio, allegedly. Two chests. Let's carry on going. Let's just have a look at the zone. Pretty foggy. Hides that hides that draw distance, I guess. Fog, the developer's best friend. Jump! He jumped pretty far, like he jumps so far that it kinda breaks reality a bit, some of the jumps. You're a bit like, oh my god, there's no possible way. He felt a little bit like he was guiding them. Ah, so that's the building I need to go to. Looks like someone's... Whoops, whoa! Looks like someone's getting guillotined. Let's go and take a closer look at that. We've got... Is that someone hung there? We've got someone hung. We've got... Is there someone in that guillotine? No, not yet. Oh, this guy's going to be in there, though. Let's stick around and get a good view of this. He can fly, lol, says Giovanni Max Gasper. Hope they did a good job on the subs. I remember the Metro games, they only ever subtitled the story dialogue, says John Bob 87. I think this is kind of the same. I'm not getting any subtitles for the incidental language. So, that woman there. Oh! I reckon there might have been a mission to save her son, maybe. He totally got guillotined while I wasn't looking. Let's go and find out what this woman wants. Sorry, land on your head. Except. Oh wait, I've got to, I've got to defend the Duchess. Oh, I've got an escort, an NPC. Ooh. Let's keep going then. Go on, walk quicker, lady. I've got to, I've got to climb that tower. Uh oh. Oh no. Whoa. <laughs> moided, ultra moided. I didn't even get, didn't even get a chance. Absolutely destroyed me. Uh, Adam's followed me on Twitter now. Thank you very much, Adam. Frankie, uh, Frankie ads. His name is. That's welcome. Thanks for the follows on Twitter, my lovers. Let's carry on. I'm gonna just try and climb this again. Screw escorting NPCs, especially when my character has zero skills. Uh, 
Up we go. Look at that, Superman jumps. I think he's got a Titanfall jetpack on this guy. We're going up. That's pretty cool that we got to see some guillotine action anyway. Guillotine action, eh? Can I get past this thing? No. Oh, God, no! Oh, you douche. Ah! Why can't he climb up that? Why can't he go around that corner? Why can't he climb that? <laughs> What's going on here? Climb that. Can't see, see what I mean about the, the glitchy climbing and the the way you'll go through things and just like that definitely needs patching his his, his movement around areas. I mean how am I how am I supposed to get up there? This way, that'll do. Here we go. Climbing and climbing Here we go. Synchronize Synchronicity. Saw the hung person and wanted you to throw a batarang to cut them down and shock the crowd. I've been playing too much Arkham Asylum. Um, he said that. Uh, Rory Youngs did. Escorting NPCs is like the most pain in the ass thing ever. Why do people still put that in their games? It's a destroyer. Uh, yeah, I'm only playing. Um, NPC escort missions, the greatest idea to ever happen to gaming, said no one ever says Macarold. Bob Jim says, You are bad! Thank you, Bob Jim. So, we've synchronised another point. There's the Notre Dame over there. That's pretty pretty, isn't it? Ah, oh, it looks so nice. Oh, look at that big castle over there. So what kind of mischief can we get up to over here? I have a feeling that most of the missions are going to be way above my pay grade. Oh, there actually doesn't seem to be any missions in here. Maybe I've not unlocked them all. That's a cockade. You can collect cockades in here. I'll show you my cockade if you want. If you'd like me to get my cockade out, I can do that for you. Jump it. My cockades aren't very big, but um, they're visually my cockades are quite expen uh, quite um, impressive. They're bright. Um, yeah, lovely shape to my cockades, but they're hard. My cockades hard to get to grips with. Um, it often takes a lot of searching to find my cockades. But I will endeavour to show off my cockade to you. I think I'm close. I think I can hear my cockade vibrating. There it is, there's my cockade. So cockades are um um like we like circular ribbon things. Um That's the worst explanation of what a cockade is ever. A cockade is a knot of ribbons or other circular or oval or other circular or oval shaped um, symbols of distinct colours usually worn on a hat. So cockades there. Danny Bannister, John and Emile Villette have followed me on Twitter as well. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Craig Green on Twitter, he says, When watching people play Unity on the Xbox One streams, I noticed less issues. Hope Far Cry 4 doesn't have these issues. So there you go. I'm playing, uh, just a reminder, I'm playing this on a far on a far cry for I'm playing this on a PlayStation 4. So um so the the I possibly the frame rate problems are just around the PlayStation 4. I heard there were some issues with the um the PC as well but I cannot confirm that or deny that. Can't confirm or deny. 
What is this? An initiate chest. Let's go and find out what an initiate chest is. Got no idea. I'm about to initiate this chest. Can I jump into the hay? Aha! I got into the hay bale! Stupid. Stupid, stupid. I totally made that jump as well. Maybe I like broke my shins, not like the back of my ankles on the edge of the barn or uh, the edge of the the trailer or something. I desynchronized. I'm okay now. Got a kind of like neon beard type thing going on. But there's the initiate chest. Let's go. Let's go get this initiate chest and find out what the hell that does. Do 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 I'm not sure what I'm not sure why people are finding my cockades funny. They're um it's a genuine thing. I was just I was just showing off my impressive cockades to you guys. I'm not I I do not I don't get it. I'm not I'm not sure, I don't understand. There must be something I'm missing. For some reason you found my small cockade funny. Do 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 do. It's an initiate chest. What does it mean? I'm going to interact with it. Please wait. Connection failed. A problem occurred while trying to communicate with Ubisoft online service. Please try again later. So, an initiate chest is something to do with you play. This looks so nice, and the graphics are going to look gorgeous, says Alex Magoo. Oh, it does look gorgeous. It just needs a little patch, that's all. They just need to give it a little, little bit of extra love. They've released it a little bit too early, I think. They've given. and it's, it's a little bit, little bit glitchy. Hopefully, it, yeah. Hopefully, they'll um, they'll be working on it pretty quick. I'm sure they, I'm sure they won't be uh, hanging around, considering the amount of um, negative feedback people have had about the um, issues. It doesn't really like it, it's not really killing the gameplay experience for me. It's just feels a bit scruffy and unfinished at the moment which in this day and age of day one updates every modern game feels a bit rushed and unfinished when they're released I mean look at Battlefield 4 I didn't get finished properly until about a year and a half after it released that was, that was a flamboyant move there I wonder if I can do that again nope nope he's just dancing on the corner Dancing on the corner. Hey, bye. It wasn't the size of my cockade that was funny. It was the shape of it. Says 2009. It's Garber. Sorry, it, my, my cockade must have got bent. I think I might have sat on it. Maybe people are jealous of my cockades, uh, Tom T. That sounds right. I, I, I can imagine people would be jealous of my cockades. Um, they visually, my cockades are quite impressive, and um, they're hard to get a hold of. Um, it's quite often you'll find uh, my cockades are quite slippy. They'll slip out your fingers uh, pretty easy. I often have to grip my cockades quite hard. Billy Cristiantos here, says 2009 Excalibur, says Miss Fragorock, so, so uh, remodulate, so's Frankie ADZ. Frankie ADZ, follow me on Twitter just now. Alright, uh, where's this mission? I missed another chest. So, uh, if you've just joined us, by the way, it's 258 people watching. If you've just joined us, make sure you subscribe. I'm going to be doing the prize draw 
in approximately 15 minutes. The cult of Baphomet. I'm kind of worried. Um, my laptop's not going to last. Uh, my my um, my charger for my um, MacBook Pro did this. I don't know if you can see that it melted today. It's the sixth or seventh one it's done it to. My laptop is running out of batteries. So if that happens, I won't be able to read your comments because uh, my laptop that I have in front of me right here. Um, will go off. So I'm just shutting down as many programs and I've got a few open things on there that maybe I can shut down. Oh, we've got Ben Cameron, Neil Young and Billy have followed me on Twitter as well. Thank you very much, peeps. Loving your work, guys. Loving your work. Right. Who's this guy? Right. I already have a mission in progress. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this, guys. You must steal two holy chalices from the Cathedral of Notre Dame and bring them to me. Stealing chalices from Notre Dame? I can do that. I reckon I can do that. <laughs> let's keep. Let's get going. Hey. So, my lovers, we're going to try and join the cult of Baphomet. This has microtransactions that go up to $100, apparently, says Jim Matep. Oops. Let's have a look and see if they haven't been on sale so far. Yeah, they're, they're not on sale yet, the... Um, the microtransactions. Uh, maybe they're uh, maybe they're on sale in America and they've not they've not got on sale in the UK yet. Maybe that's why, because uh, the game's not on sale in the UK yet. But yeah, at the moment um, I can't buy any microtransactions. Not I'd want to. I've never never paid for microtransactions in my life, Governor. Go on. What's that? Can I, yeah? No. Can I? What do I do with this door? Can, what are you doing? Interact. Cannot pick locks without the lockpick skill. Well, poop. Not sure I'll be able to get in and steal the chalices. Are you gonna go anywhere? You gonna just hang there? He's just hang. He's just hanging out. He doesn't care. He's all like, I don't care. It's got to be a way into here. Do 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 do. I'll find a way in. Any open windows? Anything? Maybe I maybe I will need the lock pick skill to continue with this mission. Parkour down! Parkour down! Parkour... That is definitely not parkouring down. <laughs> oh, there we go. He's just trying to... He's just having fun up there, wasn't he? He's just playing around. Don't push me. Don't push me, cause I'm close to the edge. I'm trying not to lose my hair. Ha 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 I'm trying to steal some chalices. Right, I'm going stealth. Ok, 
Okay, there's one chalice up there I need to steal. And there's one over here that I need to steal. Eon. I like that they're chanting my name. Climb up. Climb up. Climb up. Climb up. No. I'm gonna. I'm gonna climb. I'm gonna climb that. I'm gonna climb that. Yeah, he's gonna climb that. You go over. Oh. Okay. Parkour down. Steal that. Got it. Get up. 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 Parkour round. That's it. That's it. No. 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 What do you go round? No. Yes. That's yes. Yes. Parkour down. Parkour down. Parkour down. Yes. Good boy. Good boy. Good doggy. You can um, you can run and slide as well. Quite cool for escapids, escapages, escapages. Wow, okay, so looks like that ah it looks like the microtransactions are available in America. I've just been asked to check the microtransactions again by uh, the news editors, but um, I just did, and it's not, they're not there. I'm going to have to do my first prize draw in a minute. I'll do it once I've stolen that chalice. Nope. Parkour down. Parkour down. Parkour down! Sneaky. Sneaky Sneakerson. Steal it. My God, these guys are blind. So that suckers. Parkour left. Parkour up. God damn it. <laughs> That's so frustrating. Right. It doesn't matter if I get if I get seen now. I'm I'm doing a runner. You deserve to have your stuff stolen if you're that blind. What are you doing? Parkour right. Parkour left. Parkour through the door. That's right. Parkour through the gate. Yes. Parkour through the crowd. Crowd parkour. Yeah. Crowd core. That was a very successful stealing mission. I think I did pretty well there. I didn't get spotted once, even though I was like... There was like a million people in there at a church service. Maybe they were too busy praying or something. I don't know. Either way, I'm gonna get I'm gonna be allowed into the. Well done. You are now a follower. Battle match. Yeah. Come to our ritual. The password is the Father of Understanding. Sweet. The father of understanding. There we go. Mission acquired uh, a password, and I got 400 francs as well. Right. Okay, it's time for the first draw. I'm gonna, the first draw I'm going to do is I'm going to draw four. I'm going to draw for the copies of Black Flag. I've got Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag on the PS4 and the Xbox One. Um, if you want a copy of the game on the PS4, write PS4 in the comments. And if you want a copy of the Xbox One version, write Xbox in the comments. Now, um, so if you want a copy, and they're region 2, uh, it says on here, 
So UK and Europe only, I guess, um, can enter this. If you um, so, if you want to win PlayStation 4, Assassin's Creed Black Flag, write PS4 in the comments. If you want to win Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag, Xbox One, write Xbox One in the comments. I will uh, in a second. I'll write down as many as I can on a piece of paper until I get bored. I'll then rip them up. I'll put them in a hat, and then I'll pick out the first three that come out for Xbox One. We'll get a copy of Black Flag. First three that come out on PS4, copy of PS4. If you do win, uh, I will um, I will message you on YouTube. So if you're watching this on the Eurogamer page, because sometimes people on the Eurogamer page uh, try and answer um, in the comments over on the Eurogamer page. Uh, if you're watching over there on the Eurogamer page, then um, please. Um, Please don't answer in the Eurogamer page comments, you have to answer in the YouTube comments. That means, unfortunately, creating a YouTube name, um, a YouTube account, um, which might mean, unfortunately, creating a Google Plus account, which is pretty bad. So, PS4 if you want a PS4 version, Xbox One if you want the Xbox One version. I'm going to turn my MacBook right down in brightness because otherwise um, my laptop isn't going to last the stream. It might not anyway. I may have to cut the stream short and just do the draws so I can... because I won't be able to do the draws if my laptop runs out. It's got 32% battery left, but it's dropping really quick for some reason. I've got everything shut down now except for my browsers. Why is why is it dropping so fast in power? Right. I'm gonna parkour up somewhere quick. Am I close to anything else to parkour up? I'm not really, am I? Let's just um Let's just position myself over a busy area so we've got stuff to look at because it takes me about 10 minutes to write the names down and then pull the names out of the hat. Um, oh, there's a busy area over there. One thing um, to remember is that I will be giving away the Xbox One versions of Unity and the Mega Bloks uh, in a bit. I only write each name down once, so don't bother spamming because I won't write your name down more than once anyway. So, and the more times I see your name, the less likely I will be to write it. I know all your tricks by now. I've done these. I do these giveaways all the time, which is another good reason uh, why you should subscribe to this channel. We do giveaways all the time here on Eurogamer's YouTube channel. Not all the time, but as many times as I can. I'm always um, always pestering uh, developers for free copies of games to give away. Uh, Agent Banter's followed me, so is Iso Farrow, so is Stephen Morris Graham, so is the Meerkat as well. Thank you very much, everybody, for following. You guys rule. Right, I'm going to start writing some down now. So you can stop, stop writing. Right, so uh, enjoy, enjoy watching the crowd. La da da dee dee. Who wrote Game Boy? Uh, no, Titch hasn't been um, Titch hasn't been chewing my cables, Darren MC. It's just they're really badly made. Those. Um, 
cables. Pro Olaf wants PC, I think. I haven't got any PCs, I'm afraid. Pro Olaf. Remodulate wants the Mega Blocks, he says. Hope you're enjoying listening to the French people shout at each other. I'm only going to write a couple more names down. enough that's enough names 25% left on my Mac that's gone down 20% in like 20 minutes that is draining the power I've only got browsers open now maybe it's the stream maybe if I pause the stream right so I'm gonna draw for the Xbox ones first I wish there was a quicker way of doing this. Someone's trying to knock him off the building with a French flag says 2009 Excalibur. Lols. Right, so what I'm going to do, by the way, if you win this, if you win that copy, and I send you a message on Xbox, uh, on Xbox? No, I'm not. I'm going to send you a message on YouTube, and I send you a message almost straight away, I think. Um, so you need to go to 
youtube.com forward slash messages to read messages so if you are if you are a winner I'll message you on there and then you need to message me back with your postal address so here we go that's my Twitter if you want to follow me on that by the way you should also follow Eurogamer on Twitter right okay Xbox draw I've got them, I don't know if you can see them, they're rattling around in the bottom of that helmet. So this is for, yeah, for Xbox One versions of the game. Okay, the first winner is... First winner is the Gemster 20. He gets an Xbox One version of Assassin's Creed Black Flag. That's the celebratory... Uh, bells going off dong dong next winner is of Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag for the Xbox One is CS Crown well done CS Crown so gems to 20 CS Crown last one is in my fingers the last one for the Xbox One is Rory Youngs, I think is what I've written there. Rory Youngs. So well done, Rory Youngs and the Gems to 20. The rest of the names get ejected onto my lap. Any, I don't want any left in. It's the PlayStation 4 lot next. Let's go through here. So Gems to 20, Rory Youngs and CS Crown get Black Flag. Jumps to 20, where's the jumps to 20? Where is he? There's the jumps to 20. And Rory Youngs, there we go. So, congratulations to those guys I'm messaging you right now because <laughs> just because I don't know how long my laptop's going to last and I don't want to lose who's won um, so youtube.com forward slash messages I'm just going to message black flag to each of you if you reply with your address I'll get them sent out to you tomorrow hopefully So you've got a close-up of my forehead here. So I blame Apple for this... Um, this rushedness of everything. Right, CS Crown, Rory Youngs and the Gems of 20. They have been invited. They have been uh, messaged. Send me a postal address, guys, and I will get that sent out to you. Let's change, um, let's change Arno's position a bit. Let's go and see what's going on in here. Let's watch. Watch everyone getting cranky. I knew I watched live streams all day instead of studying. I knew watching live streams all day instead of studying would finally pay off the CS crown. So here we go. This is for the PS4 versions of Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag now. How are you guys enjoying the game? You, do, what do you reckon? Is, are you going to buy it? Does this stream make you want to buy it? Or are you maybe going to wait until it's been patched? What are you thinking? What's your views? Mark Torox Nut says it's like Emperor Palpatine is do Young Emperor Palpatine is doing a really crap game show. You like this, don't you? Take it, strike it down with all your anger, and the journey to the dark side will be complete. I think I nearly got his accent near the end there. La 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 la. 
Was my name inside the box as dead and friendly? Um, don't think it was, no. I only managed to put about 15 names in each. And I just write them down at random. I, I It's normally just um, first names I see I write down. Um, if I see the same name spamming, I ignore it. If um, But I always check just in case because I don't want to write the same name down twice. I have done that once, which is quite embarrassing. So here we go, PlayStation 4 versions of Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag are about to get picked out of the lucky pad. Here we go, first winner of PlayStation 4 is... Drumroll is... Tom T 101. Tom T 101, well done Tom T 101. Second winner is... Sorry I'm so rushed. I just want to show some more game off before I do the final draw. Uh, Dominic Harris. Dominic Harris there. This draw's taken ages, actually. It's taken about 15 minutes so far. The final winner of Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag is... On the PlayStation 4 is... Countaro 23, Countaro 23, Dominic Harris and Tom T 101. Congratulations, guys! I will message you now very quickly. Um, is it Countaro 23, Tom T 101, and Dominic Harris? Okay. La 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 la. There's Dominic Harris. So many, so many names to go through. Tom T101. Just looking for Countaro23. Maybe I can find him. Spelled it wrong. Damn it. This is fun, isn't it? Hope he's maybe he's still watching and he's written hooray. Um, thanks, Carl Aria. Come on, where's Count Aria 23? Do, 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 do. Oh, how annoying. I can't find Countaro 23. I'll message these guys, though. Black flag. Black flag. If you're watching um, Count Arrow 23, give us a message. Lots of people saying they like it, this game.
You convinced me not to buy it with this stream, Ian. Says uh, Paul Convery. Bong. Sorry about this, guys and girls. I need to find them um, uh, because it doesn't save the chat. YouTube used to save the chat for these uh, things, you see. It doesn't save them anymore. So, pretty, uh, pretty lame stream. Sorry. Count Arrow 23, if you're watching, message Eurogamer. I just need to find you. Oh, I found it! Hooray! Kuntaro23 it was. I spelt it wrong, that's what it was. Oh, there's no option to send him a message. Okay, Kuntaro23. Uh, please go to youtube.com forward slash messages and uh, send this channel a message if you can. Because there's no option to send you a message, unfortunately. You must have your messages turned off. Right. I've got 19 19% battery left. Right. Let's try and do one more mission. How long have I got? 19% battery. I'll do one more mission. Oh, I'm all over the place. What's this one here? Let Mel Lornan's psychic powers guide you to her attackers. Alright, that sounds a little bit weird. Let's do that though. I'm giving away four copies of Unity in about ten minutes time and a box of Mega Blocks. But, the uni copies of Unity are only for the Xbox One, I'm afraid. I don't have any copies of Unity for PlayStation 4. So apologies for that 20 minutes of me writing stuff and trying to find names. Hope you had a good uh, time chatting amongst yourselves. This wouldn't have been so bad if Apple didn't make really shoddy chargers that are prone to melting. I could have taken it a little bit easier. I'm going to message people after the stream. But if I lose the names now, I won't be able to find. I won't be able to find a way to contact you. Accept and track. Tall dark strangers. Oh, I read the tarot for powerful friends, and now some believe I influence those friends, and they wish me harm. Oh. I have seen my enemies in a dream. Come with me and I will sense their presence. Shout out to Crisis17 on Twitter, Joshua Jordan and Dave Kennedy on Twitter for following me. Thank you very much, my lovers. Right, we've got to follow um, Lenormand. We've got to follow an NPC. Sweet. Love these missions. You, citizen, don't have long to live. Poo. <laughs> Your husband is having an affair. I beg your pardon. Yeah. In my dream, one of the murderers was from the country. Yes, a farmer of sorts. Some kind of crazy uh, fortune teller. Oh, that woman just ran straight through the fortune teller. She's a ghost. 
as well as a fortune teller. Stealing stuff. What are we doing? This guy. Kill this guy. Sup? You might live a bit longer if you piss off. Come on, get your sword out. What are you shooting? Right, I can attack him now. I have to wind him up first because I've not got assassin powers to assassinate him. Okay, he's stabbed up. Whoa, who's this guy shooting? Get no trouble from me, brother. Right, fair play. Right, come on, let's find the other one. Give the co op Xbox One copy to me, please, says Jimatap. Uh, and Dougie, I need a co op partner, he says. Soldier. A voice What? Follow now. So we're trying to find someone for her to murder. Okay, it's this guy over here. There's a couple of soldiers. See that guy? Kill the soldier. Right. Uh oh. Ah, oh, right in the neck. Super killed him. I got, got people fighting on my side. That's pretty cool. Follow Lenormand. Let's follow Lenormand again. Murderers, says Mark Troxnuts. I'm murdering them. Kill whoever that person is. In here, are they? She's a bit crazy, this lady. So I could stealth kill this guy if I wanted, but... I guess only if I was uh, an assassin. I've got no stealth kills things. So I'm going to have to... I need to wind them up. I need to make them attack me before I can get my sword out. Come on, try and attack me. Oh, oh, oh waste. Come on, fight me. There we go. He's angry now. There we go. New objective, following Lenormand. How many people does she want me to kill? Just making me murder everyone. Goodness, her accent is amazing, says Peter Gray. La 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 And a shady character. Yes, I see him in my mind's eye. A shyster. A bandit. Wow, they're just... Just murdering each other in the street. No, I don't want to fight. I don't want to fight. No, stop it. Uh, it's over here, okay. A man from my dream! Let's go and kill this dude. Hopefully I won't have to wind him up. It's quite funny that I have to, like, really annoy people first before I can kill them. There he is. Oh, that was okay. He ran away anyway. Oh, in an oh, super blood killed. Kill the thug. 
New objective, speak to Lenormand. Does that mean I'm done? I thank you, my friend. Come to me for a reading of the tarot. You have an interesting future, I am certain. Okay, guys and girls, I am going to do the draw for the Assassin's Creed Unity Xbox One and the Mega Blocks as well. I'm going to do them at the same time. So I've got four copies of Assassin's Creed Unity Xbox One. Uh, you need to be in the UK or Europe to enter this because they're Region 2. And uh, that, you don't need an Xbox One or a PlayStation 4 for that, so anyone can win that one. You need to write Gimme in the comments I don't know if you can read that Gimme G-I-M-M-I-E they need to be in the YouTube comments to read them so write Gimme in the comments now and then I'll write down as many names as I can and then pull them out of the hat and we will see who will win why are we murdering all these people to death for crazy accent lady She's uh, some kind of fortune teller who had dreams that they were all going to kill her, so she wanted me to kill them to stop them killing her. I think she was just crazy, though. I think it was just an excuse for a murder mission. So how's the game so far, says Veneman? More of the same, um, really. It doesn't seem to have the... Um, doesn't seem to have that kind of fresh feeling that Assassin's Creed Black Flag had. I've not played much of it though. I'm still, I've still not even got my Assassin's cloak yet. I, I'm not, I haven't got any Assassin's power at all. I need to be over there. So still, um, whoa no! Ah, oh, come on! So still, I'm not the best, I can't really judge it best. What you should do is you should go to Eurogamer.net. It says it right there. Go to Eurogamer.net right there and read our review. Uh, that will give you a detailed account of the game from someone who has completed it. Uh, it will give you our final score as well. So yeah, head over to Eurogamer.net if you want to find out the review of the game. Uh, for me, it just seems like same old, same old Assassin's Creed um, without the yeah, without the nice black flag twist of the ships and things. Looks pretty. There's obvious engine issues that are going to need patching on the PS4 version. Can't comment on the place uh, on the PC. All the Xbox One versions. Pfft, no way anyone would ever be able to stick that landing. Here we go, we've got the gimmies coming into the comments now. How's my battery doing? 17%. It'll last till the end of the stream. Slowed down now. I've turned the uh, do 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 do. Turn the brightness of my screen down and everything. Stop you. Get you. Hey, you More of the same, says Mark Rocks Nuts. I love you, Ian, but you're a fountain of box quotes. I'm pretty sure they'd never put <laughs> more of the same on the box. Oh, there's a box quote, Mark Rocks Nuts. Am I in the wrong place? Oh, you cannot interact when conflict is nearby. Oh, come on. Park all down? Synchronise, there we go. Right, let's write some stuff down. <clears throat> let's write some names down.
Jump it. Parkour down. There you go. I'm writing down as many names as I can. La 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 la. Did I spell gimme wrong? Gimme! No, I didn't spell it. Gimme! <laughs> Pundry says, Timmy! Have you got Norton on your laptop, says Mark Wright's notes. I don't. It's a MacBook Pro, uh, what have I got? A Vera or something? So far, so. I did say Mega Blocks ma Wagon Wheels. Okay, that's enough, right. I've got 20 names. Now of everyone. I need to find my hat. No more names in there, cool. He looks like he's undead. Oh no, he does. He's really. I don't know why he's so grey and. Like, with a blue hue around him. Looks like he's a ghost. The ghost of Arno. Gimme, 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 you man after midnight. No point writing gimme now, peeps. I'm done. Screwing up the names, so I just tear each name up. Screw
screw him up. Let's so drop him in the box. Let's so block. Don't forget, guys, if you have just joined us, if you come here for the competition, you should subscribe here anyway. Because we do more, we do live streams here all the day, all the time. There's loads of competitions, um, so there's plenty of chances to win. If you don't win anything today, uh, often give away download codes. I'll put them in the comments section, and Peter's like fastest to put them in and stuff. Um, so you should definitely subscribe. And uh, if you've won something today, do me a favour and give the video a thumbs up. You should give the video a thumbs up anyway, but definitely if you've won something, remodulate definitely wants the uh, the mega blocks. Is my name in there because I swear this is rigged, says Jimita. It was in there until you said it was rigged, and now I've taken it out. <laughs> Ian needs a sidekick to do all this writing, name writing down, says uh, Peter Gray. One day, Peter Gray. I need to get the subscribers up on this channel first. The bigger this channel is, the bigger it'll be able to expand in the future and get lots of stuff. In the scheme, in the grand scheme of things, Eurogamer's YouTube channel's pretty small still. <coughs> We're getting there. Nearly at 100,000 subscribers now. Under 5,000 away. That's going to be uh, it's going to be great when we reach that. Right, so. First, I'm going to draw four the Assassin's Creed Unity three promos. So, the three promos of Assassin's Creed Unity. First. So, here we go. Winner one is Assassin's Creed Unity is. Gem Spark, well done, Gem Spark. You have won a copy of Assassin's Creed Unity on the Xbox One. Winner two is Daniel George Smith. That's winner two. Next winner is <laughs> Drunk Dougie. Drunk Dougie wins a copy. Jimatep's going to be well annoyed. <laughs> okay, so the next draw is for the Assassin's Creed Unity Special Edition. This has a couple of extra missions on it that the other ones don't have. So here we go. The winner of that is Mart Rocks Nuts. He wins Assassin's Creed Unity Special Edition. And now the final prize for the Mega Blocks. Is it's not a legit army helmet, no C CS crown. Here's the winner of the Mega Blocks is <laughs> it's Jimatep. Jimatep wins the Mega Blocks. So Jimatep, if you <laughs> if you want to see if you want to message either Daniel George Smith. Gem Spark or Mark Rots Nuts to see if any of them want to swap Assassin's Creed uh, Unity for the Mega Blocks. You have to let them know. So, right. So, well done, Gem Spark. Well done, ja Daniel George Smith. Well done, Drunk Dougie. Well done, Jimatep. Right, I'm going to message you both.
quick. You all quick. So Gem Spark, uh, send message. This is Unity promo. So you need to go to youtube.com forward slash messages to get the message. Uh, Daniel George Smith, you got Unity promo. Sent that message. Drunk Dougie, he got Unity promo. So sent that message. Uh, Mart rocks nuts. Honestly, the first thing I've ever won in my life, he says. Well, congratulations, sir. That's what you get for being a regular. The more streams you watch, the more chance you are of winning things. So Mark Rock's Nuts gets Unity Special. So I'm going to write Unity Special in there. And then Jimatep. Not sure if he's happy or sad about this. It's a great prize, but he wanted the game. Uh, he got um, Mega Blocks. So I'm sending that message to Jimatep. So well done. Congratulations, everybody, for winning. Uh, hopefully you'll be able to get back to me with your postal addresses ASAP because I want to post these. Um, I don't want to wait around and not post these. Pundwi says, holy cockade, I won nothing. Sorry, Pundwi. I did put your name in one of the drawers as well. Um, so apologies to everyone else who didn't win. If you did win, though, congratulations. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe this video if you've enjoyed it. Uh, I'm, I was going to carry on till 7 o'clock, but my laptop's going to die. Um, and uh, I think I've shown off enough of this game uh, already for you guys to get an idea of whether or not you want to buy it or not. Um, this is the very beginning of the game, though. I haven't unlocked any assassin's powers, so I can't stealth kill people or anything like that. So I can't really show off any of that. Um, hopefully I'll show off the co-op tomorrow as long as my charger it gets delivered uh, otherwise I'm screwed <laughs> um, yeah thank you very much for watching guys uh, it's a beautiful world but the technical limitations are killing it a little bit at the moment so thank you very much again for watching please do subscribe to uh, Eurogamer give this video a thumbs up follow me on Twitter for updates on all our live streams and thank you very much one and all for watching my apologies it was a bit of a scruffy stream um, but uh, the people who won stuff will be happy anyway goodbye and see you tomorrow